Fake $100 bills passed off at a local store. The counterfeit currency was made to look so real that it even passed a detector pen test where they make that little mark on it, Ed. Police in Willimantic say they're looking for two people who may be involved. News aide's Jackie Slater has the latest on those counterfeit bills. Jackie. And Willimantic police say last Thursday, two people went into the Ocean State job lot and paid for their items with two counterfeit $100 bills. Authorities say these bills were so high quality, it took a lot more than a detector pen to figure out they're fake. Now, police say these are the people believed to pass off the bills. A man and a woman both appearing to be in their mid-30s. They were in the Ocean State job lot on Main Street at around 845 last Thursday night. Now, take a look at the bills. Authorities say these are the fake bills. They look pretty real. They had all of the necessary watermarks and color variations on them. The store only figured out the bills were counterfeit when they were put through a money machine to be counted. Now, a bank then investigated further and says the discrepancies on them included a darker than normal vertical security line, a crooked horizontal security strip, and the serial numbers on both bills were identical. The U.S. Secret Service says there is about $147 million in fake currency circulating globally, and about 60% of that is right here in the U.S. The most common counterfeited bills are 20s and 100s. And counterfeiting money is a federal offense. It carries a maximum fine of $250,000 and up to 20 years in prison. Anyone with info on those two suspects is asked to call police.